everyone. First, thank you very much for dedicating your time for this. And congrats, of course, congrats for getting first place uh, in this tournament. And it's been a while actually that you didn't get this uh, title. How happy are you to get it again because you lost the uh, last two uh, seasons? Well, yeah, we were pretty happy. I mean, yeah, we put in a, a lot, lot of effort. effort to make sure uh, it would go right this time. A, a lot of a lot of nights on this card. <laughs> this season, you won literally every fight I heard. So during the season. You never yeah. lost a siege and the tournament as well. What advices could you give to other guilds in uh, organizational aspects to improve the structure or how could the guild be efficient like yours? I guess it would start with just organizing tasks pretty much. I mean, just to become like a G3 guild, you need to start having dedicated leaders, dedicated siege leaders and um depending on how try hard you want to go it um goes like into more layers i would say at some point you need to dedicate some more people to offense testing or defense testing testing offenses and stuff like that so it it was ideas were put into practice rather than sort of just theory crafted which we never did before in the final you put a specific defense that uh threw the other guild in the beginning the wiki def i know because i was in the opponent <laughs> guild <laughs> and we lost uh a lot of offenses because it was new and so how do you um plan new defenses are there like a few mindsets that uh think about all of it do you brainstorm how is it uh, happening in the guild well, for this one specifically, uh, we went on a spying mission on the other servers to see if they had any good ideas. And this one seemed really solid. So we started testing it and uh, well, you know what uh, what happened in the end, right? <laughs> yeah, I know. I, know, I mean, it's, it's pretty hard to come always up with something new, what's working. I mean, you, you know it yourself. Um, so... Yeah, the, the last uh, uh, final we tried something new was not working. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we yeah we basically spied and copied this time for something new. We thought it's working, and I, I think Fuki is a very underrated monster. We we, we say it uh, ourselves as we saw it the first time. It's, it it just can be trash. This season was quite different than the uh, previous one because there was a huge change. Uh, for, for example, there was um, the snipers that got buffed and the meta went way more aggressive than before, uh, for my opinion. How did you feel the meta change and how do you like it or not? I think honestly this season has been the most interesting season in so many ways. Obviously we got our title back, but also I, I guess there were finally some balance patches that were relevant to Siege with the Kamuna Vigor nerfs, the Karkana buff. Those were all clearly related to Siege and it's it's really exciting to see so many new defenses to popping up in such a short space of time. Even if they don't have a new balance patch that impacts you too much next month, I think there could still be a lot of new ideas coming up. So I just think it's, it's really quite an exciting <coughs> time to play Siege. And, um, yeah, it's, it's really good. I'm, I'm, I hope it continues that play. Oh, you used um, an interesting, funny defense. The Lulu uh, Taranis uh, <laughs> Tessa defense. <laughs> Where did he come from? It was a kind of joke with, with legends. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, but actually, I mean, Lulu is a super strong monster, right? Mm -hmm. It's super annoying. And if you, uh, if you came from this joke to fight it and see how annoying and, and how long even Lulu can solo you, right? Um, I mean, you win in the end, but it's taking ages. Regarding the season and tournament, who would you say in the guild is the MVP? We had, um, um, for the seasons, I think it's hard to say <laughs> because we, of course, looking for people normally always can do their 10 of 10. So the win rates are pretty, yeah, pretty high in mm -hmm. general. Did, did we had in MVP, we had a lot of people with a higher win rate, right? I would just take a look at the stats so we can do it properly, I guess. Uh, win rate wise, it would be vain so far. Yeah. For the whole of season four, 
Vayne had the highest win rate in AFU. Wait, what is your, <laughs> your goal for the next season? Well, we want to win. Yeah, of course yeah. we want to win. Yeah, yeah, of course. Makes sense. That's why I didn't want to ask this question because I thought, yeah, it's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll aim for fourth place this time. <laughs>